you know, as a, as a black student, I guess as a black professional, uh, you're always sort of being confronted with the idea that, you know, your, your contributions are going to be questioned. Um, right? You know, if you're the first person to, let's say, finish a test, I don't know if the, 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 the feeling would be one of congratulations or one of suspicion, like, oh, who are you cheating off of? You know, who's, whose paper did you copy? Or something like that. Uh, so what Deanda can do to do about that, I, I don't know. Maybe not much in the short term, but I think um, the more that we can highlight, you know, I enjoyed, for example, Hidden Figures movie. Um, the more that we can highlight some of the contributions of black folks throughout academia, throughout, you know, corporate life. Uh, I think that's really going to make it real that we really are competitors. You know, they used to say that a black man couldn't be quarterback because he just couldn't think that fast. You know, he couldn't think on his feet quick enough. But you know, we've seen some of the most incredible athleticism out of, for example, Russell Wilson, Cam Newton, uh, and other various NFL quarterbacks. I don't follow NFL that closely, but I do know, you know, these are some of the most incredible athletes and a lot of that's been proven wrong. So I'm hoping over the years, as we get to see more and more black accomplishment, more and more Amanda Gormans will come out and just blow the socks off of this country. I think um, hopefully it becomes a natural thing that we see young black folks leading. Um, gosh, I'm trying to think of a black male teacher that I had growing up. I had black female teachers, but black male teacher. I cannot remember a single full-time black male teacher that I had growing up. And that's, that sucks.